Hello everyone, I'm Kurt Kelly, Florida Coalition for Children. And so today I'm sitting in front of, here in my office, in front of the fireplace, seeming like I'm a little bit relaxed. Well, we are relaxed compared to last week with all of the stuff that was going on at the end of session. And of course, on Friday, they did drop the handkerchief. And so it's signy die for the regular session. And so that means all the legislation, all the stuff we worked on now just needs to get past the governor's office. And, uh, and then you'll see that a lot of that will come into uh, to, uh, statute and into uh, law uh, there in July. Let me start by saying how much I appreciate Victoria Zepp and Chip Case, our lobbying team experts this year, and a very challenging session with, uh, I think I was corrected to say that we had over 23 different pieces of different legislation that we had to work with, and they did a marvelous job in addressing a lot of the issues. But a lot of that was up uh, due to you guys because of you getting really involved and helping us as any of this legislation came out and helped us really kind of walk through the, uh, where our position should be and getting the bill in the right posture. We believe we ended up in a pretty good place in most of the stuff that we worked on this year. So now we turn our attention. And our attention is to this summer. We do have a leadership conference uh, getting great response to that. If you're one of the C-suite leaders, I wish we could have everybody. I really do. I wanted to have everybody, but it just wasn't the right timing to pull everybody back together. So we are going to have a leadership conference, a little bit smaller conference, and it's going to be a bit, a little bit higher directed in uh, uh, looking at visioning and so forth and where we're going. I think that's going to be an exciting time for us. If you haven't registered for that, uh, now's the time to make sure that you get that done. A couple of other reminders, just some things that I want to mention. You know, our learning community, Dr. Nellius and Liz Overman are doing a marvelous job. They had a webinar the other day that was well attended across the nation. And uh, I've only heard great things about it. Well, we've got another one that is coming up on the 11th. Uh, it's at noon uh, webinar. Uh, you can go on the website and see information about how to sign up. It is free for our members, and uh, it's very inexpensive for folks that are not non-members and can be a part of this. Well, with all that said, guys, we may have finished session, but now we're doing all of the uh, cleanup and what does this mean to you and so forth, and we'll make sure that we're there to help you how all of this uh, affects you. Let me also say uh, for our newsletter, uh, if you have some folks that want to be a part of the newsletter, please uh, get this to them. We try to present this to a large audience and so that they can see what's going on in the coalition and also in the world of child welfare. Send us your stories. We've got several of them this week. You want to see. Uh, there's some things that will absolutely make you feel good about the work that you do. Finally, this is Foster Care Appreciation Month. We have a lot to be thankful for for our foster families. We can't do it without you. You are critical. We know you do it for the right reasons, and we're there to support you. If you know folks that would like to start uh, thinking about fostering, tell us. We want to help in that arena as well. With all that, let me just say how much I appreciate you, how much we love you. It's such a joy and an honor to be able to serve you and to work with you. And uh, I just want you to know that uh, uh, we've got some great things on the horizon, and we're looking forward to, uh, to the summer months and then preparing for a legislative session that comes early next year. With all that, have a great weekend, and God bless you.